Hey everyone, welcome back, Keith Floor 1 by 5 Games. Today, we're gonna open up some Sword and Shield. That's right, this is a big, fat box of Sword and Shield. Now, I have to be careful because the uh, white stuff comes off very easy. So I gotta get that off. Wipe off my hands, wipe off the mat, make sure there's not, nothing around. And of course, I just realized, pop this guy up. Oh, is that shield dog? Alright. Oh, there we go. Shield dog. And 36 packs. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. Oh, there's one smashed in there. 14, 16, 18, 19. Interesting. 2... Four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eight, eighteen. Hmm. Did I count this one all? Let's double check. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen. Yes, I can't count. Okay. Right side first. We're burning through these folks. I know what I'm after. We are after Shield Dog. Gold. Sword Dog. V. And both of them V Max. Oh, and Torkoal V. There we go. That's a beautiful card. Don't think I have that one yet. Whew. First pack magic on that one, baby. I'll take it. Uh, let's see. We need. Is that all we need? I mean, we need some various rainbow rares, but those are really the one. Or hyper rare. Oh, reverse Pontiard. Stone Jorner. That's really what I'm after. So, right now. It's sword dog, shield dog, or bust. Or Torkoal. <laughs> I could change the rules anytime I want to. It's my opening. I do what I want. Cramorant reverse. Oh man. More Pico V. I do already have that little guy. Woo! So this will be my last sword and shield base set opening for a little bit. Only because we are getting in uh, Rebel Clash over the weekend. And with the new set, and I have a bunch of pre-order stuff for that. Energy Switch and a Marnie. So we'll just see how that goes. Of course, as I mentioned before, we'll see these packs show up in the specialty sets for many years to come so i'm not overly concerned i have quite a bit of the set already now it's just getting some of those rarer cards crabby reverse with a cladle it's just a matter of getting those in hand getting the promos Oh yeah, see, we'll we'll be doing some promo boxes too. Goldeen, Yamper. I ordered a bunch of the pre-release build and battle boxes that haven't come in yet. Thanks to COVID. Reverse Ros Roselia with the Rillaboom. So I'm hoping all those come in sometime in May. I'm not sure what the delay is. Oh, I know one order... So I literally have four orders out right now that are delayed. And one of them was a pre-order for the for the new mat, the binders, and a couple other items, some specialty sleeves. And so they don't ship until all the order comes in, which makes sense to me. Reverse Hitman Lee, Dreadnought. But with the virus going on, all of those items... Like the sleeves and the mat and the and the binders weren't produced. 
so we're just waiting until they could be produced and that is just a little bit of a shame not much I could do about it so I don't I'm not the type of person who worries about something I can't change reverse Pikachu nice ooh and a Sable IV so I just you know I just move forward it is what it is not much I could do about it. we'll worry about when the time comes we'll get back to some pack cracking in no time So I will have more openings in the future on this set, but it's definitely going to slow down to a trickle here. Reverse ball toy and Roserod. Mainly I want to open this box so I can finish sorting Sword and Shield base. Um, before I start opening the Rebel Clash. Because it can be a pain to sort. Reverse Poke Kid. Oh, and a Regirock V. Alright, so we're getting some pretty good V hits. Before we get too much further here, I'm going to go ahead and sleeve these guys up. Come on. There we go. We'll get Torkoal in place. We'll get a nice sleeve for Regirock. He deserves it. Get him in there. But Torkoal is the top contender for the best hit so far of this box. But we want gold, baby. We want to pull some gold. Gots to pull some gold. Slip that guy in there. I do like one Pico. He's cute. All right, still working on the right side here. Damn allergies are still bothering me. Of course, it's spring. Everyone's starting to mow the lawns and trim the hedges and all that other shit. And it just ugh. score bunny reverse poltergeist and a lantern. So it's driving my nose nuts because, of course, it's hot and we want to open up the damn house. Silly me. <sighs> but it's one of the, you know, I've been dealing with this every year of my life. <laughs> so it's not something new. Q font, fall toy, selling it. Ponyta, reverse pin curtain. And a Scorch. And the reality is, I'm going to be dealing with this again in the fall when they're doing all the damn control burns. And even when they're not control burning, when the whole place seems to be on fire, I'll be dying then too. So, really appreciate you guys bearing with me. Don't forget to uh, subscribe to the channel. I always point over here because that's usually where I put the logo. Subscribe. Like and subscribe. Hit that subscribe button, please. Could use all your support. Really appreciate those who do support the channel. And reverse crow gunk. Yes, there we go. Lapras V Max. That's a pretty damn good hit there. Put him off the side. He's gonna get a sleeve right away. Unfortunately, I already have him. So he goes behind Torkoal. That's right. He goes behind Torkoal. Still definitely an amazing card. Krabby. Zigzagoon. Gossifleur. And uh, by the way, big shout out to Pineapple Collectibles for sending me the box. Really appreciate it. You can follow her on Instagram at pineapple collectibles snorlax if you don't know how to spell pineapple you've been out of school for far too long you can also find me on instagram 1x5 games and post random stuff there as well muna snom and corvus squire I do a, ooh, and the Glaring Berserker. 
I'm kind of surprised it's the only I've only had two hollow hits. Um, so what I do on Monday, we have what I call Magic Monday or Magic Minute Monday, where I literally open one pack in a minute and post that on our Instagram. And then Friday, we have Pokemon Friday, where we open up one pack again in a minute and post it on our Instagram there. Sent a Scorch Reverse. That's nice. I might need that with uh, Musharna. Can't remember if I have that one or not. I have all the uncommons. I know that for a fact. So, yeah, follow me on Instagram. Check it out. We're getting up there. Probably going to do a giveaway at a 1,000 followers. I'm going to do something a little special. Some people on there are giving away vintage packs when they hit a 1,000. I would love to do that, but I am not made of money. I apologize. I do not have that money to do that. Reverse ball toy. Rosa Rod. Maybe in the future when I start making money off the channel. I don't know if that will ever be the case. But for now, I'm sorry. You'll get a prize. You'll get a cool prize. It ain't going to be vintage pack. So, <laughs> Maractus. Pikachu, which I think I only need the reverse of. Sizzlipede. Wooloo. And a reverse Zal Salandit. And Inteleon. Nice ha uh, rare there. Salazzle. Already have all of the incomes. So. Alright, we're going to move on to the left side. Shake the pack, make sure there's nothing there. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18. Alright. And we started off with Shield Dog. There's got to be a gold in this box. There has to be. Right? Isn't that like a given? A shield or a hyper rare? Snom. Mawile. Reverse Noctile. And Cinescorch. Seemed to like Cinescorch today. I mean, that's kind of a golden rule, I thought. I'm being facetious, by the way. Ball toy. Oh, no, Lanoon. Actually, I'm going to scoot that over and start a new pack. Or a new stack. Chinchow, Krabby, Mencino, Pony Top, and a reverse more Peko. Ooh, with Gengar, Hollow. I do not know if I have him yet. I am looking forward to when Charizard shows up. So I'm not going to get too crazy with uh, Rebel Clash. We'll see a couple box openings, but I'm really after the set with Charizard. And then we're going to go all out. I hope. Oh, full picks. Reverse. Ooh, with a Sword Dog V. Damn, I can't remember if I have him or not. I don't think I do. That's a good hit. I do love Sword Dog. He's my favorite out of the two. Mainly because I played Sword. Sorry, Lapras. For me, he's still a bit bitter hit than you. I know that's a shame. Mudbray. Hoot Hoot. Pincurch. Bullpix. Nicket. Reverse Nicket. Just for good measure. Oh, and a Berserker Hollow. Yeah, still kind of surprised. I've only gotten a couple Hollows. I don't even know when the next set comes out. Is that in July? I should probably look into that. I'm going to have to start saving up my damn money. Krabby. Encino. Ponyta. Cottony. Score Bunny. Reverse Pokemon Catcher. And Drampa. And I knocked over the Uncommons. Not just a couple. It's all right. So 
So I hope everyone's keeping sane during the COVID lockdown. I know we're locked down for a few more weeks, it sounds like. I don't have the full report yet, but news is trickling in that we'll be closed most of May. And my, you know, there's a lot of positives so far. Hoot Hoot Reverse at my day job, Pulp Tea Geist, that productivity has increased. And I think everyone's shocked by that. I don't know why. I think the studies have proven time and time again that if you give your employees flexibility and the ability to work at home, that they're actually more productive. Pretty sure those studies have been done for a few years now. And the results have been out there, but, you know, it's taken something like COVID to really show the working, um, the businesses, right, that this is possible. Of course, some people will uh, abuse the system. They always do. There's always someone who's going to abuse it. Reverse Wulu with a Kramer in. But it's uh, pretty encouraging to see that. Uh, the folks I work with, pretty hardworking, dedicated people. Always enjoy working with them. So that's positive to hear. But I wouldn't be surprised if, if they start making people, they being more businesses not necessarily my business i don't know what path that would be what that would look like reverse choodle and a cinderace hollow but i wouldn't be surprised if more businesses moving forward do move into a remote worker program where most people are working from home think of all the electricity they're saving uh the water right less toilet flushes toilet paper ink and uh, paper from printing because now we're all doing using digital media to send each other stuff. Coffee, you know, my work would give out free coffee and they would go through tons of it a day. Reverse Rhyhorn. Now, if you put it back, oh, Turtonator on the employees who are working from home, well, that's a different story. So I don't know. I would be surprised if they look at as a cost-saving measure to have people work from home. So we'll see. We'll see. This, uh, you know, it's still very fluid. Um, cases in Arizona are still going up. Reverse Kaparaja and Musharna. Oops. Reverse piles here. So I'm definitely curious to see where we all land at the end of this i'm just very thankful to still have a job my wife still has a job we're able to continue to work and we do have that work from home option my office turned my home office turned tcg central i'm gonna have to probably put in a lot more work into this area reverse obstagoon and a hollow rillaboom to make it more user friendly, but you know, my views from the kitchen table are pretty damn good, so it's kind of hard to want to come back into the dungeon, if you will. Ponyta Sobble, Maractus Mudbray, Ponyard, and Reverse Heat More with the Nine Tails. Damn, I was thinking I would get more hits by now. We are definitely down into the last, oh, about quarter of the box. Crow Gunk, Silly Cobra, Mencino, Fulpix, Mana, Reverse Team Yell Grunt. Oh, oh, we got something. And a Lapras V. I don't know if I have him. I may not have the standard Lapras, and I may have pulled the VMAX a handful of times. Let's see. Let's go ahead and sleeve him up. Regardless. Pretty sure I have all the other Vs. So there you go. You get to replace your brethren. Your big brother VMAX. Mona. Snom. Grookey. Shelder, Mawile, Blitbug Reverse, and a Noctowl. 
I don't know about you guys, but the way that I used VMAX in the game, I would go to the gym, battle the trainer, wait till he or she VMAX theirs, took one or two, because they typically wait until the end, right, to the last Pokemon, their last Pokemon before they do that, take one or two hits of damage, then... VMAX. Oh, yes! Haha! <laughs> yeah! There's a rainbow card. I still love to call them rainbow cards because they are. They're so pretty, too. Snorlax VMAX in the house. Taking over the show. Stole the show. So I, I would just wait, take one or two hits damage from the VMAX because it's not really that much damage. And then, boom, I VMAX. Psh, Blast that little bastard out. Done. Beautiful Snorlax there. Love that card. Can't get enough of that card. Of course, I already have him. But I am collecting Snorlax PSA cards. So we'll see. I may send him in for a grading. Ooh, reverse Evolution Incense, and a Stone Joiner VMAX. Damn, looks like all the hits were in the last last couple packs there. There we go. We got two more packs, though. Let's stick this guy. I know I have him, too. With that being said, though, I do not currently have a subscription with PSA and no one really knows what's going to happen with the COVID I'm likely going to wait until later in the year do subscription and then send in a handful of cards that I've chosen when I say handful I'm thinking more like a hundred and uh, just go from there we'll test it out later in the year so I wouldn't get too excited I'll probably do a video closer to that time explaining what I'm sending in and then you know a few months later we'll catch up and see what PSA says all right grab the locked for a rare the reality is they are going to be backed up when they get into the office as they've been in lockdown and they have not been able to as far as I know all the communication I've seen um, not a lot of their folks have been able to come in and do grading so we'll see all right, folks, last pack. We got Lapras VMAX on the back, or on the pack art. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Please, please, please check out some of my other videos over here. Throw a like button on there. Check me out on Instagram. I think you'll like the content there. It's a little bit faster pace, or I could throw up random things, and I do throw up code cards and such. And, uh, you know, just... Stay safe out there. Really appreciate your support. Stay at home. Do your best. Wash your hands. All that jazz. And we end with the thievel. Alright folks. Really appreciate the support. Till next time. Cheers.